Good morning. So this morning I want to read Poultry Guys and I want to thank Candlewick Press for giving us permission to read their books online. I want to start with, you see the chicken getting ready to cross the road and what's coming. What do you think is going to happen? <gasps> I think the chicken got hit by the truck. What do you think that means? What happened? Well, what's the last thing you remember? I remember crossing the road to get to the other side. You mean the other side. Anyway, I remember crossing the road to get to the other side like I always do. Peek! You mean, um, fried, yes. Roasted, yes. Cooked, yes. In the soup, yes. What we're trying to say, chicken, is that you are now a poultry guy. Oh, no. Oh, yes. A noisy, troublemaking ghost chicken, which means a cockadoodle boo time for you. Yeah, time for you to play dead and twist your head. But I'm just a little spring chicken, or I guess I used to be. It's time to get foul, foul. Can I be a friendly ghoul? Nope, you're a ghoul. Now that you're a ghoul, is to turn someone's sunny side up into sunny side down. But I don't want to haunt anyone, especially not innocent readers who are just trying to enjoy a nice story about an unlucky chicken. Psst, are you okay? Don't be such a chicken, chicken. Yeah, don't be such a weak in the beak. Show a little pluck, Chuck. Hatch a scheme and get a scream. <laughs> ghosts of a feather haunt together. Mm, I may not, I may be a ghost, but I will not haunt anyone. Nothing you do or say can ever change that. And besides, I'm not even scary. Do you, they look scared maybe a little bit? Ah. Was it something I said? Oh well, good riddance. <laughs> uh oh, now what is getting ready to cross the road? Thank you all so much for joining me this morning. And if you've already got your Halloween costume picked out, drop it in the comments and let me know what you want to be this year. Thank you all so much for joining me.